The time for complete regeneration continues onwards now, in seeing the divine shifting of a heavenly reality to surface on your planet, in a cosmic energy of being a source vibration. This happens to be extremely powerful changes that are going on to prevent the massive extinction of the human race as you know it, in then seeing the divine intention that comes with light paths. That connects with who I am as your commander Ashtar, of who we are of the angelic realms, of the galactic council, of the galactic federation of light into more modes of ascension pathways. Inside of a new golden reality in a higher state of awakening comes the depths of noticing the generating of a higher dimensional nature, with the complete shifting in pure energy. As the natural respectfulness that comes with more galactic homecomings comes your own reunion stage with our star fleet, into the consistent stages of unfolding the magical essence of pure grace. It is then a representation of only light energies, in seeing the natural receptiveness of more harmony to be your normal everyday life. As you notice it is often not normal to exist in much respect among many humans but to exist in a heavy set of judgments, of disrespect, and separated thinking. It is now the end of the depths of lower dimensional energies which keeps leading to more humans destroying themselves, one another, and seeing the path circulate around this world. The time of war against one another has already come to its end, with the new incoming energies of a higher vibration to amplify more on your world with the cosmic shifting in healing natures. Through the deepening of your own energies, the calmness of climbing more of the ascension ladder continues to manifest only complete stages of joy to enter into, in full consciousness. From the paths of opening more transformed paths of uplifting yourself into more source creations comes the immediate respectfulness of maintaining more light fields, as a pure energy. As you notice, you are each the energy of the light, not able to be destroyed in nature, in which you see the human form now as a holographic reality that is not real, in which your true form exists as pure light. It is important to realize this, in which you notice many humans are going to try and use the mind to convince you otherwise, that you are only a body, that is going to die one day. That is all the foolishness and immature nature of the lower ego self, which is not able to see the galactic uniting that is placed here in our galactic communities as one light crew. With your bold movement through the mobility of reshaping how you are living, there are no ways to keep you from seeing how important this transformation remains in your daily life. Through the light combinations that are going on now, this opens the inner ability to reshape your energy field into that of a galactic citizen in this lifetime. The completion phase of your life continues to be to exist in more service, to see your mission as a field of more structured living, in which this is absolutely important to see in your healing ability. As you are feeling the core of your cosmic connection, the feeling of abundance continues to bring you into the dimensions where portals are opened up more. This happens to be the era of no aging, of mature beings who have evolved beyond the stage of aging completely, to look young forever, with a natural stage of transformation. With only allowing for you to feel the kindness of your being to manifest only harmonious vibrations, then there are great modes of your activation that is taking place in this moment. Each of you are continuing to be monitored on this reshaping in your knowing that you are here to create more miracles on this world. Inside of a dimensionality in bliss, this warm entrance connects you with who we are of the Galactic Federation of Light, of your angelic guardians into more focused intentions. The vibrations of unity continues to bring you into more commitment on this service path into the evolution of a more advanced energy system completely, into the depths of more gracious fields of light. As a responsible nature, no disrespectful natures are allowed to enter into the kingdom set by our light team, in which this respect needs to continue to be carried forth into divine restorations. 
in noticing that the holographic reality of oneness remains now, you're entering into these new paths of change as your own role in divine unification, in completion. This ancient language needs to be placed more into your DNA sequencing, in which this upgrade remains as the steady preparation into a new system of abundance. The Cabal has long taught many generations of humans that there was not enough for all, and that your world was overpopulated, which is completely based in lies, and fear. The fear of the lower ego self continues to be being selfish when you are entering more of an awareness of higher dimensions, in which the stopping of the lower realms continues to open you into new gateways of joy. Those in the lower vibration are often not able to experience the unification with life, as they are not working on themselves to uplift their vibration higher. Similarly, those who are unwilling to work hard for the light continues to exist solely in confusion, death, destruction, and stress. It is not in your life path to continue to exist into the physical death experience, in which you are each gifted to enter into a realm where magic exists, where the foundation of pure freedom exists. This transformation continues to be your own inner working to connect with the synchronicity of more dedicated roles for ascension gateways. It is important to notice that you are strengthening your auric field more, in being more stable in every part of your life, where you are representing the core of the light. All through the gateways of these eternal dimensions comes the prosperous nature of upholding only a complete integration into your joyous natures into the cosmos. The cosmic realities of being here to prepare yourself more daily for this shift comes the respectfulness of bringing you into more systems of peacefulness, in abundant stages of uplifting realities. It is all in your nature to shine more into the cosmic connections of our restored divine fleet, into seeing the spanning of your etheric wings in a galactic homecoming. We stand in eternal outer space, we are the angelic realms, we are the galactic federation of light.